Welcome back. And Hala joins me now in the studio. Hala, the Haiti earthquake dominating the headlines here in China as well. That's right. The death toll from Tuesday's devastating earthquake is unknown, but it's thought tens of thousands are dead and the humanitarian crisis has only just begun, with hundreds of thousands more left without basic medical supplies and drinking water. It's a tragedy that's hit particularly close to home for the Chinese nation after an earthquake in Sichuan province in 2008 killed nearly 70,000 people. Let's go now to to BON's Kevin Jia in the newsroom to see what Chinese internet users are saying about the tragedy. Kevin, what has the reaction been to this event from the Chinese people online? Well, most web users in China have expressed their sadness and sent their best wishes to the people of Haiti who suffered this terrible disaster. They're also very sad to learn that some Chinese who were part of the UN peacekeeping mission trying to bring security to Haiti could also be among the victims of the quake. As in the rest of the world, the Haiti earthquake has completely dominated the headlines here in China. And people are trying to find out whatever they can from the media. Now, Kevin, as we just mentioned that, of course, China suffered a horrendous earthquake in Sichuan back in May of 2008. Are there any comparisons being drawn between the two events? Yes, there are. Some people have said that it is the poverty which has resulted in such a large number of deaths, even though the earthquake in Sichuan was technically a more powerful one. They are also saying the poor quality of the buildings may have led to more people dying than was necessary. Many people are calling on others to send money even though the country has no official diplomatic relations with China. They say Chinese people went through the same experience last year and can empathize. Some internet users from Sichuan say they'll never forget the pain they went through, but say they believe the people in Haiti can be equally brave and endure the disaster. One internet user even suggested the Chinese Premier Wen Jiabao should help after what he did following the Sichuan earthquake. This person says Wen was outstanding in organizational terms, but even more so on a personal level, and that he's the only expert who can cope with such a large-scale disaster. Thanks, Kevin. Well, interesting there, Fergus, how when making the comparison between the two events, the earthquake in Sichuan and the earthquake in Haiti, that one netizen is actually picking up on the, the, the fact that poor uh, construction of buildings might also contribute to a, a very high death toll. Now, that's a particularly sore spot here in China, um, given that the, the quality of the buildings um, was very, very controversial, given that so many of them actually collapsed. Sure, sure. It's terrible to, to make comparisons, but it would seem also that in, in terms of numbers of fatalities, uh, the officials in, in Haiti at the moment saying that possibly 100,000 people, which could mean that even worse than the, the earthquake in Sichuan uh, in, in 2008. And, uh, but good to see that uh, in, in this case at least that uh, both sides, both Taiwan and, and mainland China, both sending uh, rescue teams and sort of forgetting differences about uh, Haiti in this case, and both working for the people who are still buried there. Well, stay with us. BOI News continues in just a moment.